Nation. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Dish Nation. So when you pick up your phone, there are these little yellow guys in there with faces. Those things are called emojis. Now, they finally broken through the touch screen, and they're on the big screen. I love emojis. Me too. The movies are out today, so we sent the homie Andrew Freund to meet the stars, TJ Miller, Patrick Stewart, Maya Rudolph, and JT Austin. Welcome to the world inside your phone, where everyone is expected to act one way their whole life. Aw, snap. Ow. <laughs> Son, please tell me you weren't laughing just now. What if you get sent out on the phone making the wrong face? Dad, I'll make the right face. Then I would finally fit in. Sweetie, you're so handsome when you make that face. Now, the last time... We, you know what? Roll the tape from the last time we spoke. No, 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 no. no. I tickled you, and is this sort of you... Do you want me to do that again? Is that kind of your... No. Okay. I mean, I just want to sit in your lap. Okay. Okay. We do the interview like Sure. This? Okay. Hop up there, little fella. Okay. All right. So, TJ, what emoji represents your soul? Hmm. The hugging emoji. The hugging emoji? Mm -hmm. Should we have a hug? We are go for men. <laughs> Who? Me? <laughs> What's he doing? He's making the wrong face. Yeah! So if you two were going to create your own emoji for something that's not already there, what would that be and why? Well, I'm a huge Prince fan, so I would make a, a Prince symbol emoji. I think that's, that's helpful. That's helpful. I would use that. Which ones do you guys use the most in your own daily life? Sometimes, and I haven't expressed this yet, I hope, I hope you'll still uh, think well of me. I enjoy the turkey emoji, and then I... Um, make him fart. Ah. I use mm -hmm. a little bit of air coming out of the turkey. <laughs> I, I find that it, it, it tickles me. And his poop. I totally approve of that Thank usage. You. So, it's, you know, I have to ask you, is this the pinnacle of your career? You know, I, you're a very established performer, a theater performer. Well, I would say it's probably the beginning or the base or I might say the bottom of my career, <laughs> in terms that there is much to build on it. Welcome to the Loser Lounge, where the emojis who never get used hang out. What's up, High Five? <laughs> this movie made me feel bad for the ones that we don't use, because they're, like, in the movie, yeah. they're, like, in some room. The misfit emojis. The misfit emojis. I, I totally see what you're saying, yeah. So, Jake, how do we, like, bring these back into the cycle? Well, we got to make a second movie. And then we got to, you know, incorporate these characters. It's, you know, one movie's just not enough. There's too many emojis. So is this, is this your plea to the Sony powers to make this a franchise? I'm just saying, every emoji needs a story. Last emoji you used. You know what? I've been using the desk lamp a lot. Okay. I just send someone a desk lamp. If they say hello, give me a high five emoji, or I send them a desk lamp. Do you feel bad for emojis that don't get used a lot, like in the film? That's why I've been sending the desk lamp. Okay. I've just been going through and sending prawns and, you know, not even surfboards, even more esoteric stuff. The guy with the spyglass, is he a detective or a scientist? He doesn't have a lab coat. We need to get a detective on this immediately. But which emoji is the detective emoji? 